good morning. Say good morning. Hey guys, hope you're doing well wherever you are, whenever you're watching this. And I thought it would be fun to just vlog our day today. It's Friday. We're at home. And um, we don't have very much going on today. But it's going to be a good day, isn't it? Isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> He's like, mm -hmm. I'm not sure why this camera thing is. So, um, first things first. Got my coffee. And we are going to put my favorite creamer in it. And that's it, guys. Not too much fuss with the coffee. Really, whatever. It's quick these days and does the job. Yeah, that works for me. Did you sleep good last night? Mm hmm. Thank God I have a good sleeper. He's been sleeping through the night since he was three weeks old. I honestly don't know what I did to get that. <laughs> but I'll take it. He's always been a good sleeper. Yeah. You want to go play now? He's already had his bottle, so now he's ready to play. Let's go play. <laughs> Can you clap? He loves to clap. This is his new trick and he's so proud of himself. Clap, baby, clap. Clap, baby, clap. Yay! Yeah. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> really? Okay. That's, that's good to know. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Is that right? Austin, look. He's still not. He hasn't figured out this camera thing, Chris. He's like, what is this thing? What do you want to do today? Chris has been working from home ever since quarantine hit and we love it don't we you love it do you love it I love it every minute of it you love it I love it you love it do you love it do you love having daddy home yeah Chris used to have a long commute, so he wouldn't get home till late at night. But now he gets extra family time and extra Austin time, which is priceless, honestly. <laughs> Mornings are just like this, pretty much. He plays until he gets tired for his nap time, which is usually uh, around ow whoa 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 be gentle um 9 30 10 o'clock so we just play we put on mickey mouse and he gets rambunctious and destructive <laughs> i have to watch him like a hawk because now he's like into everything right now he's trying to take down the lamp so why don't you go down and crawl. Yeah. And <laughs> Daddy's working in there. Chris, you may want to close the door because he's coming in. <laughs> he's coming in hot. <laughs> yep. You want to do some work? This is oh, what? It's yeah, Brody's bed. <laughs> this is definitely well, the new norm. Type away. Oh. <laughs> Teaching him how to work. How to use work, 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 the computer. Work, work, work. Gotta work, 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 work. Gotta work, 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 work. We're just trying to enjoy this time of being still, not having too much going on. It's kind of nice every now and then. 
Okay, I am going to drink my coffee, watch some GMA, and I'll see you back in a few minutes. It is breakfast time for this little one. <laughs> I'm feeding him some cereal and strawberries. Looks delicious, doesn't it? <laughs> and we're watching Mickey Mouse. Mickey, Mickey Mouse. Do you remember? <laughs> oh and there's his father always coming around the corner, <laughs> scaring him with loud voices. That's what he does. He loves it. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Good job, you didn't flinch. Yeah, he's, he's learning. We, I feel like all I do right now with him is feed him. His um, appetite's increased. So, now he's definitely interested in more like table food. When we're eating, he wants what we're having. So I'm having to get more creative with food. And he also still like takes his baby food and his formula. So yeah, it's a lot of eating <laughs> for this baby boy. He is zoned in. <laughs> you are zoned in, aren't you? You love this. Is it nap time? It's nap time. <laughs> Let's go eat some milk and rock. So, sound machine is on. Got his milk. Today. I feel like I have a lot to do, but really I don't <laughs> because it's getting we're still in quarantine. Um, but there's a lot of cleaning and organization stuff that I could do today. I'm kind of feeling it. Um, make sure I'm filming, yeah. And Austin's birthday's coming up. Which I am like getting very emotional about. I cannot believe it's turning one on June fifth. Oh, this time last year I was huge. <laughs> oh my God, what a time! What a time! And it truly does just fly by, like in the blink of an eye. There, already grown up. It's, it's wild. It's such a crazy thing. Um, so anyways, I'm getting a few things for his birthday. Um, 
and just clean up the house, organizing, all of that good stuff. My day is definitely obviously planned around his schedule um, with his nap times, feedings, all of that stuff. So right now it's kind of like my time to breathe and get like anything done that I want to get done personally. Me time, I just ran a bath. Um, and this is literally my time to get ready for the day or else I can pretty much just plan on being in pajamas all day, which is okay. Um, definitely done that many times during quarantine, but, um, I find that if I at least get semi ready for the day, I have a little bit more motivation in me. I don't know, something about putting on real clothes, putting on some makeup, that kind of thing. Makes me feel better and gets me going a little bit. <laughs> but during this season of all of our lives, which I'm sure everybody can relate to this, I've been so minimal on my, like, getting ready routine <laughs> I definitely do not get like ready like I used to usually I would like wear you know like, clothes going out do my hair do my like full face all that good stuff usually I'm in gym wear because I try to do some sort of physical activity during this morning nap um so it's just better to get my workout done in the morning than it is in the afternoons or evenings because let's be real by that time i am tired <laughs> i'm ready for an adult beverage you know that kind of thing um so mornings are like definitely my most productive times. I really need to get in something today. I've been doing Tone It Up videos. Um, love their app. There's so many good workouts on there. And obviously like on Instagram and YouTube, they also have like lots of resources and workouts for free that you can do. So I've been doing that and then going outside and running that's been a really good thing for me during this time just to get outside get some fresh air yesterday i was talking myself out of going for a run but i'm so glad i did it because i had a really good run felt good the entire time love when that happens and i um, came back and just felt so good and just proud of myself I hear someone coming upstairs. Hi! Totally just doing my makeup with you guys. Um, <laughs> this is a very, very quick <laughs> makeup look today. I mean, really. Most days I'm not even putting on makeup, but I just kind of feel like. I should put on a little bit for you guys. <laughs> Look a little bit more presentable for the camera. Lord have mercy. Most of the stuff I put on my face is skincare. I am a skincare consultant with Rodana Fields. Amazing, amazing company. And um, so, yeah, obviously I wear a lot of their products not because I sell it truly because it's freaking good and it works I wouldn't be selling it if they weren't good products and if I truly do not think that they were legit I would not be putting it on my face <laughs> but um, basically I just put some sunscreen on um, some hydration serum, um, 
which is amazing. It keeps your skin hydrated all day long. Oil free, any skin type can use it. It's like a drink of water for your face. It's amazing. Um, and then I put um, my go-to um, sunscreen. Oh, don't you just hate when you get mascara on your eyelid, I swear. Um, this is the sunscreen moisturizer that I always put on my face before I put my makeup on. So good. Um, it has 50 SPF in it. And then my Radiant Defense. You can't even see the label because I've had it for so long and it's rubbed off. The stuff, I swear, I've been using it for months now and it never runs out. Like, I just don't understand. But basically, this is like a CC cream. Um... Or a tinted moisturizer uh, they come in all kinds all different shades um, I wear beige and it's got SPF 30 in it love this stuff it makes my skin so smooth and um, my makeup goes on perfect with it like I can tell when I don't use this my makeup does not look nearly as good um, it's great and it's lightweight super lightweight light coverage perfect for the summertime love it so yeah a lot of stuff that I put on my face, obviously, fit skincare. It's right in my fields. That's it, guys. I mean, super <laughs> easy. I just put on some powder, um, my Tarte concealer, my Ride or Die concealer right here. Um, I did put on some Becca Hydra Mist like setting powder right underneath my eyes. I gotta help out my eyes here. Coming to mommy, you don't get much sleep. Um, I did my hourglass bronzer. Been using that forever. Um, and my blush, drugstore blush. Um, what is this? L'Oreal. This is L'Oreal. Bait powder blush. It's great. That's it. And. I mean, I have not done a thing to my hair. I did brush it a little bit and put it in a pony. So now it's 12 o'clock. So basically, he will be waking up any minute now. And it's time for the next session, which is lunch, playtime, before he goes down for his 2 o'clock-ish nap. Sometimes 3. So, got to look like two two and a half hour stretch with him coming up yay <laughs> and just like that he's up what did i say 12 o'clock he would wake up pretty much clockwork with this one <laughs> oh no what's the matter <laughs> Mm-hmm. You're very attached to your passy. What now? What do you want mommy to do now? Lunch? Mm -hmm. Lunch. <laughs> Lunch for all of us. Lunch for all of us. Back in the kitchen. My favorite spot. And I'm making us some lunch. Um, so, leftover pizza from last night that I made. I just put some extra mushrooms on top. We're huge mushroom people in this household. Um, and making a little salad. So, um, got some baby spinach, avocado, and I'm chop up some strawberries. Um, and then for dressing, I usually do a little mix combo, which is delish. Oh yeah, I'm gonna put some parm. In it as well, but oh, Chris, I forgot to get some more of this stuff yesterday. Dang it! So this garlic spread, this classic vinaigrette salad dressing, so delicious um, and pretty. Hey! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> oh, naked baby coming through. Um. So yeah. So this is the salad dressing that I put on 
pretty much every salad that I make. It's so good. It's really good in like sauteed vegetables if you're going to make like a pasta salad. It's so good. So anyways, I'm just going to put some on there. Um, and then this is the Brianna's Homestyle New American Creamy Balsamic Dressing. Delicious. This little combo is so good. And light, healthy. Perfecto. Um, what you put him in? What did you just put him in? Oh god. Okay, yeah. But little yeah, good little pieces. Austin is obsessed with avocado. Oh, don't get his green bib right there. But he gets so messy now when he eats. Yesterday. Chris decided to give him pasta with red sauce while I was gone to the grocery store and I came back and oh my god, it was a mess. But he was so happy. He had like the biggest smile on his face. Like, look mommy. He ate a ton of it too, but we had to put him in the bathtub immediately. Alright, so salad and pizza for lunch on a Friday. Not too shabby, right? Um, Chris gets fed really well now that he's working from home. Don't you, honey? Some days. Mm -hmm. I would say most days. We do, or I do, a lot of cooking. I love to cook. I come from some really good cooks in my family, especially my granny. And I feel like when I cook that, I don't know, it always makes me think of her. And so a lot of my recipes and how I cook is definitely influenced um, by my beautiful granny. Southern food, comfort food. But I do do a lot of like, I try to incorporate a lot of vegetables, but it's the southern vegetable way. So it's really good. Um, but yeah, my granny definitely has given me a love for her food and to cook. So thanks granny for that. Alright, I'm going to get my food on and I'll see you later. Bye. Like it? Notice that Chris. If we want him to have like one of these um, pouches, we have to give this to him first, or he won't have it. <gasps> yeah. Yeah. We have to give him 
like his pouches first before we give him any table food or meal where he will not eat it like he's not interested. Little munchkin, little monkey. Try to get some protein in you. Keeps looking at the camera. Da 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 This is the aftermath of Austin's lunch. I mean, could you get any messier, son? I mean, I'm just wondering, is this gonna require a bath? I mean, it's all up on you. Oh, it's on your diaper. How did you get that like that, huh? <gasps> yeah. <laughs> You're so dramatic. little booger is all clean now. Austin. Austin, what are you doing? In your passy in your little bucket? Austin, look at mommy. Austin Maverick. Mm -hmm. Hi. Are you all clean now? No more avocado, baby? You busy. You're so busy. Oh my god. I just put the Johnson and Johnson lotion on him. I'm telling you, there's no better smell in the <laughs> world than that classic Johnson Johnson baby smell. And this outfit. <laughs> I think this is the last time he'll get to wear this because it's pretty tight on him. But it's so cute. I see. Look at mommy. Look at mama. Say hi. Are you, do you feel good now? The sheet has his name on it. <laughs> hi. Say that for mama. Say that. Good job. I mean, look at it. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, play some more while mommy can clean up. <laughs> Um, let show you. This is, look at that classic smell. Oh my God. So good. <laughs> the things that entertain a baby. <laughs> He's getting very sleepy. Delirious. Yep, yep. <laughs> An eel. He gets happy and then sad and tired. Are you ready? It is 2.15 in the afternoon. It's about time to get on that nap. <laughs> that afternoon nap. Let's pray is a good one. When it's not, 
Oh Lord. It makes hey, for a very hard bye. evening. Hey. 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 Oh. Hey. Hey. He loves his daddy. <laughs> All right, we gotta start getting sleepy. I need I need the nap fairies to come <laughs> to put you to sleep. Where's the nap fairy? Nap fairy, please come. <laughs> Where's Austin? There you go. <laughs> Where's Austin? There he is! Okay, Nat Fairy. Nat Fairy's coming to put you to sleep. So it is now 3.15 and to be honest, I am tired. Like this is the time of day where I feel like so sluggish and I would do anything to get in that bed right now. But I know that I can push through my tiredness and work out, do something around the house, be productive. I seriously battle it around this time every day um i mean sometimes i do take a nap because you have to listen to your body and give it what it needs but today i feel like i should push through not take a nap and work out i didn't get my workout in this morning so i know i'll feel so much better and i'll have more energy if i do it and it's only like 20 25 minute workouts he also still not asleep He's having a hard time going down. Sometimes he goes down without a fight. I would say most days, but today's not one of those days, which makes it extremely challenging for me to do other things. Like he is standing up in his crib. I'm really hoping that he just goes, just puts himself to sleep. That's how I've trained him. So hopefully he'll do it this time. But anyways, I digress. This is what I'm going to do. I go to my Tone It Up app, just like this. And this is their Summer Tone Up program. And I think I'm going to do a HIT workout, which I may regret. Nah, you never regret a workout. This is so true. Like... Once you do it, you never regret. So I'm thinking about doing this supercharged hit one for 20 minutes. And you hit, let's do it. And it takes you straight to Welcome it. Welcome to the summer tone up! Woo -hoo! I mean, their intro gets me pumped. <laughs> Like, all I have to do is watch the intro usually, and I'm like, okay, let's do it. <laughs> I love towing up. They're so good. All right, here we go. 20 minutes. I can do this. Good news. I got my workout in. Bad news. <laughs> Bless his heart. You know? This is mom life. This is motherhood. Babies are so unpredictable. You just don't know what the day is going to be like. I mean, typically, like, he'll take his afternoon nap, but some days he just will not. And he's so tired, but he still will not go to sleep. I just spent, like, 20 minutes in there soothing him, 
doing everything I could, pulling out all the mommy tricks in the book, nothing. So, Chris has sweetly offered to go in and <laughs> take them for a little while. <laughs> so, yeah, but I got my Tone It Up workout in. It was so good. So glad I did it. I remember, you'll never regret a workout. It makes me a better mommy, a better wife, a better me. Um, so, yeah. Um, it is 4.13, so I'm going to try to clean up up here before we can kind of like chill out for the evening. And then I'm going to cook something for dinner and open up a bottle of wine. Sounds really good right about now. Like 5 o'clock. Come 5 o'clock. We are having a beverage. <laughs> TGIF. It's a little bit later now. It's dinner time. So I'm back in the kitchen. And tonight I'm making one of my very favorite lemon pastas that's inspired by Chiada's. Um, lemon pasta, Giada De Laurentiis from Food Network. <sighs> Everything she makes is so good. Um, I've never made a recipe of hers that was not good. And Chris is manding the grill outside. <laughs> He's relaxing. Um, we're grilling salmon and lemon pasta for dinner. Sounds so good. Cannot wait. And I am freezing my wine, my Sauvignon Blanc. That's like my go-to wine. I love it in the summertime. That is what I crave. A dry, crisp, cold Sauvignon Blanc. It is the best. The lighting. I'm trying to get better lighting here. Um, so, that's what's going on. I've got Baby in there eating his dinner. And he is upset with this rotini chickpea pasta this is what it looks like and um, it's got 11 grams of protein so it's pretty healthy it's a good like protein and fiber food for him especially since he's not able to eat eggs right now for protein so anyways He's loving that, and I just have this like on hand, and I put a little bit of butter in it for him. Sometimes I put red sauce in, in it, and he just goes to town. Um, but he's always, I mean, it makes a mess. So um, what I do is I just like pinch it and <laughs> give him very small pieces, and he just cannot get enough of it. It's actually pretty good. Like, if I wanted to eat a healthy pasta during the weekday and not splurge, this is definitely what I do. Um, but, I mean, if I'm making a pasta dish, um, entertaining, or like, it's now the weekend, I always, I prefer going with the regular, normal pasta. Um, that's my preference, but for like a, an easy weeknight healthy meal and you're craving like some carbs, that is such a good thing to use. And I, we always feel very good afterwards. Like we never f feel like super full or bloated. So yeah, um, I'm going to get the food going. Salmon's on the grill. I'm going to pour me a glass of wine and get this evening going. It's beautiful today. It's such a beautiful evening, so maybe we can sit outside. <laughs> Yippee! Oh yeah. Salmon for the win. Standing beside my pasta. It's bowling away. Mm. The best. There's something very satisfying to watch pasta cook. 
some bowling water. Is that just me? <laughs> so, I have to wait till it's al dente. And then I'll pull the noodles up and then make the delicious lemon butter sauce that goes on it. <laughs> Glorious. All right, I'm gonna try the pasta and see if it's ready to go. If it's al dente, let's see. Try to not burn myself doing this. Let's see. Mm. Perfect. It still has like a little bite to it, a little firmness. So we're ready to go. Ready to rock and roll, people. What you're gonna do is you're going to transfer this pasta, look at this, into another pan. Oh my goodness. It's gonna be delicious. So good. I like doing this as far as like, um, transferring the pasta to another pan because I feel like you get some of the pasta water stuck to the noodles and it makes it creamier. All right, so here we go. I've got my bowl of pasta, as you can see. Always reserve pasta water if you want your pasta sauce thinner. And then this is the magic sauce right here. It's lemon and butter. Fresh lemon. Perfect. Now you're just going to mix it up. I mean, look how easy this is. This is ridiculous how easy this is. And this by far my favorite pasta that I make. And then Parmesan it up. Put as much parm as you want in it. I usually put a little bit of pasta water in at the end to um, thin it up a little bit as far as the sauce goes. I serve this a lot when I have family or friends over and they love it. They absolutely love this pasta. And then I put a little bit of pepper, um, olive oil. Use really good olive oil if you can. Yum. And then I'm just going to dip into my pasta water a little bit. Bobby. Just put a little bit more in there. Just like that. That's all you need. <laughs> Chris is singing in there to Austin. And that is it. And you know what? I'm also going to put a dash of um, pasta, I mean, um, <laughs> white wine. I'm just gonna do a little bit of white wine in here. Because why not? Awesome. Let that, I would put it to low to medium heat and just let it heat up for a minute. And guys, you got yourself a delicious pasta for any day. I like to cook this on Friday nights because I, this is my, my little treat. I love pasta. And then we're gonna serve that with our salmon that we made. Chris grilled it and it looks delicious. Show you what everything looks like. So we have our pasta. Yum, 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 yum. And our salmon. Bon appetit. I'm going to get you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you. Here I come. He's coming. Come. He's coming. Come. You better go. You come. better go. <laughs> <laughs> we got a baby gate today. 
Yay! We've had that one, but we needed another one. So, hopefully this little monkey can't get out. And we finally put our coffee table back over here. It was over there. But, just doing some rearranging. Austin's got 15 minutes to play before bedtime. I try to get him down by 8 o'clock now. Which is super nice because I'm tired. <laughs> Mama's tired. How was dinner, baby? It's good. It's really good. I cooked the salmon. You did. The salmon was great. Do you love the lemon butter so uh, pasta? Yeah. He's a big fan of it. What are you doing? What are you doing? Can you tell everybody good night? Can you tell everybody good night? So, I think we're gonna end our vlog here, guys. It's been a long, good day in quarantine. Um, very thankful to be able to be home, be healthy, have our baby here, and just enjoy family being together so thanks for watching um, and if you enjoyed this vlog at home please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more and we hope to see you in the next vlog see you later bye